You know them as the Banana Boys, one of the driving forces behind the Rally Banana, a craze that has completely taken over Mississippi State baseball. I just saw cameras going up and up and up, and that's when I realized I was like, we're, we're kind of a big deal. Behind the Banana Boys nicknames upcoming MSU seniors Chip Goza and Storm Davis. The duo say the name happened by chance. And Chip was like, there's going to be a million people with shirts on, you know, so I'm just hoping that one of these, you know, shirts we have on nobody else has, so we were kind of want to be different. And we got there and Chip kind of looked at me and was like, uh, I thought there was going to be more people with a banana shirt on, it's kind of just us. Our phones were just buzzing. We could just tell whenever we were on TV, because just zzz, zzz, zzz. Oh, we were, we were just on the TV, <laughs> and it just got to where it was nonstop. The two are Bulldogs baseball faithful going to every home game in the new dude this past season. And when the Diamond Dogs battled their way to Omaha, there was no way they were going to miss out. You know, we went to Tallahassee. You know, we, we went to Hoover for the SEC tournament. You know, we went to Nashville for the Supers. Like, we got to find a way to get to Omaha to you know cheer these guys on because it just wouldn't be the same. We were thinking about how we were going to pay for it, and my dad kind of jokingly said, "Hey, start a start a good fund me." And I kind of thought about it, and I text our little group message of a couple of my buddies, and they said, "I mean, it can't hurt thinking that I might get." $300 out of it. But thanks to some help from some friends, the funds came pouring in. That's when Goza and his family decided they would donate the rest of the money to Blair E. Batson's Children's Hospital in Jackson. As of Saturday's first pitch, the account raised more than $2,000. I had no idea that it was going to get anywhere close to this. There's actually three kids from our hometown that are at Blair E. Batson right now. So it just kind of hits a little closer to home. So everybody can almost say, you know, hey, th these guys, they're, they want to go to Omaha, they want to cheer on the dogs, but, you know, also they're trying to get it to Batson, and, and that's something people relate to is because Batson does so much good for everybody. Two Mississippi kids making a difference, hoping to follow the Bulldogs to the first team national title in school history, all while having the time of their life. We have, we, we have, we have extras just in case, but this is the original. How has this moment been for you, Ralphie? I'm a shabba. Speechless. <laughs> Speechless.